In this demo, we'll use the APIs in the OCI Document Understanding Service to automatically convert text, tables, fields, and more into structured data, classified documents, and train custom models for specialized needs. The Text Extraction API can identify text in your documents and return it in a structured format. In this example, we see that even certain types of handwritten text can be identified. Each line in the text is returned along with its position in the document. Here's another example with a longer document. We see each line of text is extracted and returned in order. The Table Extraction API can be used to extract tables from documents. The table in this document has been identified, including the table structure and metadata like column names. In the second example, we see a larger table with a large amount of data extracted in its entirety. The Key Value Extraction API identifies common fields in certain types of documents, such as invoices and receipts, and returns the field type alongside the field value. The service identified several fields, including the vendor address, invoice ID, invoice date, and so on. If line items exist in the document, those are also returned in structured format, including the field type and value. The Document Elements API can be used to identify elements of the document, such as barcodes, QR codes, and signatures. The Document Classification API can be used to categorize documents into predetermined types. In this example, we see that the first document is identified as an invoice with a high degree of confidence. The second document is also correctly identified as a receipt. Custom models can be created to better classify documents or identify fields within specialized documents. The training data set can be uploaded from object storage or created in the data labeling service UI. Fields can be highlighted directly on the document samples. To automate tedious processing tasks within the Document Understanding Service, as well as many other AI services, get started with OCI today.